kind crew. And this month is dedicated to being positive. What can we do to be positive in our classroom? Well, let's make a list. These are just starters, so feel free to pause, pause, pause. The video at any time and write down any great ideas that come to mind. But remember, you can add to this list all month long. First, let's start by smiling. Even if you don't feel like smiling, do it anyway. Did you know that when you smile, it sends chemicals to your brain to make you feel happier? Go ahead, give it a try. Oh, let's go, let's go. Give it a try. Write a list of great memories that you can look at when you need a positive boost. We all have off days, but one off day doesn't outweigh all the good ones that we have. You can also keep a gratitude journal. Write three things you are thankful for each and every day. It will actually train your brain to focus on the good things. <laughs> Surround yourself with positive people and activities. Play your very favorite song, eat your favorite food, anything to make you happy. Also, get together with friends and be around people that make you feel motivated and optimistic. It's much easier to be positive when we're working together. Teamwork makes the dream work. A good role model. Who do you know in your life that is a positive person? What do they do to maintain a positive attitude? Take note and try to practice some of these things. Practice makes perfect. You can be that role model. All right, guys, gotta go. But remember, you can use the Be Positive classroom materials all month long. I'd love to hear about how you are being positive. If you see something positive, write about it. Go to our Facebook page, Be Kind People Project, and shoot me a message. Be sure my name, LV, is in the subject line. Catch you later.